Hi guys, this is Dudes from the Soul Unsung, and this is my book, Gossip for the Soul, number two. So, uh, I'm going to go ahead and get right into things. I got some pretty cool um, things this week, So, and I'm really excited to share them with you, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. For the Around the World Art Tour, I received a um, an ARCA Kill Me Softly for review by Sarah Cross. It looks like it's going to be pretty good. I'm guessing that it's got something to do with uh, uh, fairy tales and it's sort of a retelling itself. So I can't wait to see what that's all about. I also received through Around the World Art The Hunt by uh, Andrew Caputa. And I've heard really good things about this. Again, I don't know much about it, but I've heard, uh, I've seen uh, some, re some reviews talking about how um, good this was, how action packed it was, how suspenseful. And uh, even Rochelle made talking this book up and if she's talking this book up I'm reading it for sure because you know it's going to be an awesome book Let's see um, from Tommy Vaughn I received this rock in my heart it's like a it's kind of sort of like kick lips for rock moms not necessarily for soccer moms, and this is supposed to be pretty good. Um, it looks like it's going to be kind of fun to read, and uh, uh, Follow Your Dreams, uh, Tommy Vaughn, she actually signed it for me, so um, this will be, and she wrote a little letter, a little kick-ass letter on the um, letterhead, and uh, so I will be reviewing this uh, within the next month or two on the blog. From Harper Teen, I received for review uh, Anarcha Black Watch by um, Jenna Burtonshaw. This was kind of a surprise that came to me. Um, I believe this is the second book. This is the sequel to Shadowry. And I haven't read the first one, so I'm going to have to get a copy of the first one before I can read this one. But it looks pretty good. It's, um, it's part of a, a, an eerie trilogy, I guess, or something. Um, it's, I know it's dystopian fantasy, so, and it's satisfyingly creepy, so I'm kind of excited to uh, dig into that. So I also received a surprise uh, from Harper Teen in the mail, So Close to You, by, um, Rachel Carter. Um, this is sort of like, it, it's, they're saying that it's, it's sort of like, um, the compelling romance of the time traveler's wife meets, uh, the imaginative, imaginative suspense of, um, before I Fall by um, Lauren Oliver. And I love Lauren Oliver, and I'll read anything that she writes, so I'm definitely, definitely excited to uh, have this Anarch of this in my hands, and I will totally be reading this soon. I think uh, this will be either in late May or early, early June, so I'll be looking for that on the blog as well. And I also received an arc of... Um, uh, Drain You by M. Beth Bloom. This one <laughs> is sort of like um, My So-Called Life Meets Twilight. Uh, I love My So-Called Life. For those of you that didn't really know, it was a um, hit show that aired for one season on MTV back in the 90s that had Claire Danes and Jared Leto in it. And um, that's not the part that scares me. The part that kind of scares me is the meets Twilight. I'm like, oh, dear Lord. But I've heard good things about this, so I'm, I'm excited to read this. And I got some 
uh, swaggy goodies in the mail. Um, let's see. I think from Stacy Kennedy, because I'm part of her uh, street team, I received um, some little, like, uh, postcards of, um, well, it's not a postcard, it's bigger than a postcard. I think it's just like a little card or something of Frostbite, book two. Um, demonically tempted. I will be reviewing this on the book, on the blog within like the next few um, next month or two. And I also got like a, a magnet, which is really cool. And you know, some little postcards. That's from the first book in the series, I think. And of course, that one's from the um, second book that was just really for uh, this series. And I'm kind of excited about that. I also received some really awesome signed swaggy type stuff from um, da, 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 da. Kathleen Peacock. These are her. Uh, these are little um, signed uh, postcards that she sent, um, some really cool stickers, a couple of, uh, book plates that are signed, and of course, a, a few little bookmarks that are signed as well. So, I'm excited about that. I really enjoyed getting to talk with her, uh, via email, and she's just, like, this really sweet and, and awesome person to get to know and she's just like a, a totally fantastic author and if you haven't bought Hemlock yet you can have a chance to win it on my blog. I have an arc of it that I'm offering in a giveaway and uh, it's also out in the stores and you can um, head on out to your local bookstores or click your way over to uh, Amazon or Barnes and Noble or Book Depository wherever you choose to get it and pick up a copy uh, through there. I also won um, one of my copies of Glass Houses by Rachel Kane come in that I won and I won this and they sent along another um, 3D type I don't know if this one's 3D. Yeah it is. You just can't see it. Can I do it? But it's a 3D type um, Morgan Bill Black Dawn bookmark. So, yay! Thank you uh, to one of the girls that uh, sent that to me. And the things that I'm the most excited about came in. My um, ordered copy of Insurgent is so pretty. Uh, and my mother was just totally ecstatic when uh, she found out that I had gotten this book today. Um, because she's fixing to sit down and read uh, Divergent ten, uh, within the next, or start it tomorrow, or within the next few days, and so I know she'll be trying to pry this one from my hands as soon as she's finished with it. But I'm so excited to finally have like a, a, a finished copy of this book. I'm excited to read it. Look at that fat thing. It's so cool. I'm so excited. And my favorite thing that I found, or well, yeah, quite possibly my favorite bookish thing that I pre-ordered came in the mail today, City of Lost Souls by Cassandra Clare. This is absolutely, without a doubt, one of my top three favorite paranormal, young adult paranormal series. I swear, Cassandra Clare, she's just really, really amazing. Look at that cover, it is so pretty, look at Clary and I'm so excited. See the back? And then you can see the inside flap. And then the back flap. I'm just so excited that I have this book in my hand. Yay! So awesome. And because I'm such a geek and I love all things Doctor Who. I've been looking for like three years. And I finally found Tardis Blue Nail Polish. Tardis Blue. See, it's Tardis Blue. 
is so pretty. It's China Glaze, and it's called First Mate, but I'm marking that name out because it's now called Honorary Tardis. And it will be on my fingernails this year. Okay, so now that I'm finished being a dork, <laughs> you guys can laugh at me all you want. I'm totally cool with being picked on. I used to it and I pick on myself so it's all good anyway um this is me signing off if you have any uh thing to say about any of these books any recommendations any thoughts any reviews that you've written leave them below and I promise I'll come visit your blogs and I will come visit your little I am in features like stacking the hills by the lovely or um, Mimi's book haul or you know those are just to name a couple but yeah I'll totally come see you rad people I'm out